Isaac, can you believe this? Our wedding day is here. I cannot wait to see you so soon and be able to call you my husband today. Allie, can you believe that today is finally here? I'm pretty sure that was my first sentence too. I want you to remember to not be too nervous about any of it today. This is the ultimate celebration of our love and what a wonderful love it is. I Isaac, you look good, and I'm happy that we're all here to celebrate this wonderful day with you. There was always a large part of me that imagined this moment would consume me with anxiety, but to be honest, I couldn't have been more wrong. Rather than being anxious and scared, I am filled with excitement and confidence because I know wholeheartedly that I'm marrying the love of my life today. And I can't help but smile when I think about sharing what we have learned together with our children one day soon. <laughs> This is such a big day for you and Isaac. We're all so happy to be a part of it. I love you so much. I love you. It's a true miracle that we are here today. I will never take any of it for granted. We both know what life on the other side of addiction looks like, which makes today even more special. I can't wait to spend an eternity experiencing all of life's joys and challenges with you. I love you so much, Allie. Flash booby. Thank you for being the grand prize. I love you beyond words. Your future wife. Oh my goodness. You look beautiful. It's a 10. It's a 10. It's a 10. We are gathered here today to witness and celebrate the marriage of Isaac and Allie. As I look around the room today, I am astounded by God's love and grace. It is truly a miracle that we are here gathered to celebrate the communion of these two souls. Allie, I was ready to accept a life filled with lies, but fortunately for me, you walked into my life and changed everything. From the moment we first spoke, something changed in me. I no longer need to run away from my past because my past is what brought me to you. I am forever grateful for you and all that you've brought into my life, and I promise that my love for you will only grow from here. Isaac, after almost exactly a year into my sobriety in 2018, I got an Instagram direct message from my future husband congratulating me on this epic milestone. It turns out you also got sober around the same time as me, and if that isn't faint, then I don't know what is. Oh, I do. Allie, I vow from this day forward that you will never face this world alone. I vow to love you every day for who you are, who you have been, and who you're going to become. I promise that wherever life takes us, I will consider you home. I promise to put my own sobriety before anything else, as it is the foundation of our relationship. Standing here today, it all makes sense. Every bit of struggle and pain that I went through led me straight to you. And for that, I am eternally thankful. It is such a blessing to be truly known and loved by you. I love you. You forever changed my life by teaching me what it means to love and showing me that I am someone worth loving. 
by the authority vested in me by the great state of Wisconsin, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the crowd. All right, Allie, I know that we're making the right decision, and I know that I'm the luckiest man alive for getting to marry you. We're going to be incredible parents. I just can't wait to start on this journey with you. Isaac, oh my gosh, I am so, so, so excited to be your wife. Today is just a small, the little start of our journey as husband and wife. I'm so lucky and I love you so, so, so much. I'm amazed by the miracle that has been and is taking place today. Here are two souls that have been connected in a way that only the word love could define and only God could design. From what I have seen, together they lead a life that is wholehearted. The wholehearted journey is not the one of least resistance. It's a path of consciousness and intention. It is quite counterculture these days. The willingness to tell their stories, feel the pain of others, and stay genuinely connected is not something that comes easily. They understand that and embrace the challenge. Together they look at life and say, I'm all in. 